Oh my gosh. Whew. Hey y'all. <laughs> It's a brand new day, and it's early. It's probably like at this point, 7.45. I wanted to get out of the house way earlier, but I had to struggle with my kids because they're not feeling this new movement I have for them. <laughs> um, you guys know it's a constant journey. It's a constant battle. Sometimes it's a battle. Well, yeah, it's a battle with me trying to lose weight. And I said to myself, like, um, if I'm going to be losing weight, I need to get my kids to lose weight, too. We all need to lose weight. Here, I tell them they need to be ahead of me and me catching up with them. But it's a new, it's the first day. It's our first day. Um, it's a countdown for me. I really want to lose a dress size for my birthday. I have three months. Um, my birthday's in March. Um, I have less than three months <laughs> because I think it's the like the fifth. Oh, happy birthday, baby! It's my youngest birthday. He's ten. He's double digits. But my thing is, and I had this whole conversation with my kids. Like, it's. <laughs> um, I have this whole conversation with my kids with setting a goal and actually fulfilling it basically you know what i'm saying and i don't want to keep setting goals and not actually fulfilling them i want to be a better example to my kids i want them to see what it looks like to set out to do something and actually accomplish it um so that's what we're doing um i do want to lose a whole dress size before my birthday i don't want to say wait i don't want to lose I want to set a goal for a dress size. So, right now, I currently wear a size 18. I think I, not 18. Look at I'm already speaking things into existence. I wear a size 20 right now. And, um, I want to get down to a full 18. I don't know if that's a realistic goal or not, but I'm setting it for myself. So, um... Yeah, I just got like a little piece. This is a piece of fabric that I wrapped in my head. Um, our goal is to get back before Tion starts school. So yeah, we live in a ghetto, y'all. I'm just gonna keep it real. We live in a straight up ghetto. But anyways, look at the uh, like the fog right now. Like, literally, I had this talk with my mom. Like, I need to push myself to do this as many mornings as I can. Um, it is going to be a struggle. The only reason I say I know it's going to be a struggle is because I already work nights. You know what I'm saying? So, I have to do these. I want to do this in the morning and um, get it over with. You know, just do it, get it done, start my day, and be cool. Um, so that's where my push comes really mentally because I'm going to be super tired, but I feel like if me and my kids are doing this together, I'm doing it for my kids and my kids will see the benefit and, you know, we'll all push each other to do it. This morning, I must admit I had attitudes, but I just want them to be able to look at the big picture. So yeah, this is me starting my morning. And um, you guys will definitely see if we're able to keep this up. <laughs> you guys pray for me, like literally, like seriously, pray for me. Because you guys know, on just watching my channel, that this is a thing that I've just been keeping up with or trying to work at. Trying to set goals and actually trying to um, do different things to lose weight. And if I want to lose that dress size before my birthday, you know, it's going to feel good wearing a different size. It's going to be another step, you know, further in, in what I want to do. And you guys know I want to get weight loss surgery. Not weight loss surgery, but I want to get a tummy tuck. And I already want to be in good shape. So all that we have to do is just move like remaining fat and extra skin and stuff. 
But yeah, I'll be back. Thank you, bye. Okay, I'm back. I got my second one, my middle one, right there. He's keeping up with me. Um, my oldest is giving me a really big attitude. He's being really grumpy. Honestly, between the four of us, me and him needs to lose the most weight. Um, honestly, me and him both can stand to lose about 50 pounds. My middle one, I said good 20 pounds, good 20 to 30 pounds. And my youngest one, he needs to lose about 10 pounds. Um, it's kind of upsetting. Um, and I'm just gonna be honest and just keep it really real with y'all. I feel like my oldest son, he lacks a lot of motivation. And he, and I don't know he's a teenager, but you know, my middle one is a teenager too and he usually has better attitude about things. I don't know if it's a personality thing, but um, he's really, he's very stubborn. He's been stubborn ever since he was a little kid. Um, he chooses to give me attitude. Um, he's being very grumpy. Um, I can't really talk too much about that. I'm really grumpy in the morning too. But it's the attitude. It's like, I'm trying to, it's like, hopefully you see the big picture later on. I hope he understands what I'm trying to do and sees the big picture later because the grumpiness and the attitude has to go. I'm going up like a freeway hill and it feels good. Whew. Guys, we have a lot of homeless in our area. A lot of homeless. Whew. This will definitely be a good start of your day anyways. Getting that first workout in. Getting that first push in the morning. Whew. All right. Whew. Got me some water right here. Definitely getting ready to take a swig of that. Whoa. Ooh. Mm. Ooh, it was really early in the morning. It's like five o'clock in the morning. Oh, I hope you guys didn't see my room. My room is a mess. It's 5.04 in the morning. Me and the boys is about to get up and go for like a 20 minute jog. Just to start our morning off. Um, one thing I'm noticing that it's probably easy for me to do this stuff on my days off. Um, so hopefully we did we went working out yesterday We worked out yesterday and went jogging yesterday Um the kids gotta get up for school. So I'm waking them up early to be able to work out for like 30 minutes before school And then I'll take them to school or whatever and then um, I did just wake up I didn't even wash my face or anything. I hope I don't have like anything in my eyes I'm sorry if I do I just opened the camera up right away before I even got myself together but um yeah so i'm pushing myself and i'm pushing my children i don't want to like i said set goals for myself and leave my children behind because i want them to be able to set a goal and you know fulfill it like i said before it's extremely cold outside it's so cold Ooh, is this cold outside can you guys see that oh no that's cold. And I know that's cold because I used to work in that type of weather. It's cold. You have to layer up. Hey. You said you're very tired. Mm -hmm. But you gotta push yourself. Set a goal for yourself. Plus getting up this early gives you a good start on your day. It's still dark out. It's like five something in the morning like I was saying before. I know I look a hot mess. I still got my bonnet on. Um... It's not that bad. I thought it was gonna be really, really cold. Um, I am double layered though. I do have my bind on my stomach. <sighs> um, don't even know if you guys can see that. My boys are in the background. Um, yesterday, like I said, we went jogging. Me and my oldest one jogged. Niggas, don't blame it on me. Why y'all blaming stuff on me? I didn't even do nothing. 
<sighs> Anyways, um, what I really want to do is push myself to jog. I was able to jog yesterday and it felt really, really, really good. But I kept at a um, slow pace. I didn't want to overwhelm myself or like run out of breath fast. But I actually did a pretty damn good job, actually. Um, so I'm gonna try to do that again this morning. Um, yeah, um, I don't know if I told you guys, but my goal is to lose a dress size for my birthday. My birthday is in March, so I have three months, well less, because you know, every day is a day less. Um, so yeah, I'm like team lose a dress size right now. Um, so yeah, we'll talk more about that or whatever later. But um, yeah, the weather's not, the weather is 37, 30 some uh, degrees out and it's not that bad. I can deal with it.